y'all doing today? Welcome back to another REI Live Caregiver Moment. My name is Kion Church, a.k.a. the Big Hearted Caregiver. What do I do? I help voluntary family members with distressed loved ones to become paid caregivers through our personal assistance service agency called Reliable Aid Inc. Now listen, today's episode is not letting your parents or your loved ones get sentenced to a cold stop nursing home. Now listen, before we get started, if anybody in the viewing audience today would like to personally work with Mr. KC or a big hearted caregiver or become a big hearted caregiver, all you got to do is put it in the comments, get started, and I'll get right back to you, I promise. Now listen, the big, the big thing is not letting your people get stuck, not letting your older folk, your family members, your husband, your wife, your mom or dad, not letting them get stuck, not letting them get sentenced to the cold stop nursing home. Now, I'm going to tell you all a secret, man. I took care of my mom and dad. I took care of my mom till the day that she died. And uh, she kept going to, like, the rehab. She kept having problems, kept having to go to rehab, kept, you know, they kept having to, I guess, reset her life and get her together. So, as you know, rehab, nursing home, it's all the same thing. just depends on what you're there for. But my mom really couldn't stand being there. And she was like, listen, if you don't do nothing else in your lifetime, boy, you need to get me home. Mm. Now, I don't know if y'all heard about that. You know what I mean? I don't know if y'all heard what I just said. I don't know if you're picking up what I'm putting down. But my mom wasn't having that. She said, look, boy, make sure if you don't do nothing else, get me out of this nursing home. Hey, listen, man. I know it sounds crazy because we're so used to hearing about our loved ones getting sentenced to a life at a cold stop nursing home only to be taken care of by a stranger because the family didn't have the time, money, or resources that they needed to take care of the family member at home. Now, everybody needs to make a living and providing care can be very time consuming, making a decent paying job just out of reach for most voluntary family caregivers. Now, what if I told you it was possible to get paid for the work that you're already doing caring for your loved ones at home. Now, listen, I don't know if you heard me or not, but when my mom was speaking to me and she was saying, get me out of this nursing home, what was going through my mind is, how the heck am I going to get some money to take care of myself and my mother? You know what I mean? It's hard for one person to take care of two people, especially if you got to do things like come out your pocket and feed them. So listen, everybody here is looking for the good solution. Your, your parent, your loved one, they're in Medicaid. They're in the long-term health care program. You know what I mean? You know the big-hearted caregiver personally because we talk every day. All you got to do is give me a call, give me a shout-out, say, Hey, KC, I'm looking to get paid to take care of my mom and dad. You know, we're kind of struggling over here. We need a little help. What I'm going to do is I'm going to connect you with the paycheck. Talk about a win-win. Now, I don't know. You know what I mean? I always tell the same story. I got a good friend. You know what I mean? His name is actually the same name as mine. Good dude. He tells me all the time. He says, KC, money's not important. He says, but guess what? If you don't have no money, it's going to be real hard for you to breathe, brother. So guess what? If you're in the audience right now, what I'm going to need you to do is smash the wow face. You know what I mean? Give me some hearts. Give me some likes. Put in the comments where you watching this from, hashtag your city, hashtag your state. You know, hit the little button on here so you can go live with Mr. KC. You want to get all the live notifications because when the big hearted caregivers goes on, it's our time. You know what I mean? And you need to be with me. Check me out on anchor.fm forward slash the big hearted caregiver. That's where I do the podcast. You know, all these good messages and stuff, they go straight to the podcast. Miss Ladea hooks it up for us every day. Um, check us out on YouTube. Uh, ReliableAid.inc, you know, the best in-home health care channel. I don't know how to really get you there. I don't know the link. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to ask Mr. Ladea to drop the link for us in the, uh, in the comments. So what I need you to do, tell as many folk as you can. Start a watch party. Tag your friend. You know, the guy that you told me that's taking care of his mother and, they, and his mom has Medicaid and he's not getting paid. Tag him. Tag his name in the comments, start a watch party, do what you got to do. But you don't want to be letting your friends just watch me and you and they not getting paid. And you know they struggling. Help them out. Turn them on to me if they need to, if they need to get down with this good uh, paycheck with the, for the caregiving. 302-689-3240. 302-689-3240. 302-689-3240. All right. provides a highly trained staff for in-home and facilitated assistance. All you got to do is call me. You already know the number. I love you. 
Don't let anybody shame or blame you into thinking that taking care of your parents or your loved ones is a bad thing. We only doing it to get the blessings. Mr. Saigon in the building, how you doing today? David, how you doing today? My other people on here, I don't want to butcher your name up. How you doing today? If you're here, if you're watching me, start the watch parties, share, like. Also, uh, make sure you put in the comments, hashtag your city, hashtag your state. Where are you watching this from? I know you're a big-hearted caregiver just like me. Put it in there. Let everybody know. You know what I mean? Now, look, we're going to be back on tomorrow, so make sure you know what I mean. You, you, you get down with me and you be here tomorrow. All right? Don't forget to uh, get them hearts up, get them likes, get them, get them wild faces up, because we need them wild faces. This, this health care is important, man. Take care of your family members till I get back to you. Talk to you soon. Thanks.